before we talk about DeFi, we need to understand one more topic, DAO or Decentralized Autonomous Organization. In simple words, a DAO is an internet native organization that is collectively owned and managed by its members. Let us consider corporate governance of a traditional publicly traded company. The company is owned by its equity shareholders, legally called members. The shares carry voting rights and the voting rights can be used to influence the governance of the company. The larger the voting right holding, the larger the influence. But shareholders or more precisely voting right holders do not have much control over the day-to-day -day asset allocation within the company. The shareholders have to trust the managers that the managers allocate resources based on shareholders best interest. As it turns out, the managers often prioritize their own best interest over the interest of the shareholders or owners of the company. In corporate governance, this is called an agency problem. Now consider an organization in which all asset allocation happens automatically in line with a structure pre-approved by the majority of the members. The whole governance structure resides on a blockchain network as a smart contract or set of smart contracts. As blockchain networks are immutable, the governance system cannot be modified randomly. Any modification has to go through a proposal and voting mechanism. The voting mechanism is also pre-programmed. So, all the fund allocation in the organization happens in an automated and auditable way. This is what a DAO looks like. 